I left Coach John Paul in the car, I was going there. So you left Jose in the car and the two gunmen were still there? Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Did you see anything that happened to Jose, Jose and the gunmen after that? Okay. Before, when I ran up there, opened the back. The taller guy, as I said, the taller guy went around to Jose's side. The shot I want now come around to the door that I was. Oh, I knew that I was there. And he go inside the car. You saw I know this nigga line. What's the deal? It's your boy Ronnie the Boss, multi platinum and Grammy Award winning producer of Lil Wayne on the card of three. Plies, Lil Boosie, Mr. Magic, Rocco. The list just goes on. You know what I'm saying? I'm rocking with my girl, Amber Alert, on the takeover on the AATI network. Ladies and gentlemen, this is your girl, Gemini the Queen, with DJ Amber Alert, always by my side. Uh, Today, we here because, you know, we've been following the XXS. How, how come every time I say it, it ends with S? We've been following XXX murder and everything about it. We've even interviewed a motherfucker that was accused of murdering X, but, uh, and it's still up, but today, people, trial, trial has started, so what's goody or what's not, because this motherfucker right here, eh, sir, hello, I don't know, y'all ready? Mm-hmm. Uh, let's go. Oh, not that way. <laughs> ask you something real quick first. Um, did you go inside the branch? I don't. I don't remember if I would have found you. After some time, I don't. I can I don't remember if I didn't go inside. Okay. To your best of your recollection, did you wait outside for Jose? I think so. And how did you know 
um, what Jose was even driving. Were you familiar with his car? I know Jose's car. Okay, what kind of car did Jose have? He did have a BMW. What kind? Describe it if you don't know the, the model number or the model line. So it was a little two-door BMW car. He did have a black. I'm sorry? A black two-door BMW car. Okay. When you say little, are you familiar with BMWs? It's a small car. I don't know the, the model of it. Okay. Yeah. Was there any distinct for anything distinct, for example, about the doors? When the doors open, it flip up in there. Okay. So what some people um, uh, commonly refer to as butterfly doors? They yeah. open up, yeah. like almost like a wing-like fashion? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Oh, hold on. And hold on, hold on, hold on. Nah. Nah, I mean, I get it, but hold on. <laughs> At that point, were you aware why you were there? I didn't realize that he was going to buy a bike at the time because he was looking around on the bike, all the bikes. Okay. Do you recall what, if anything, Jose had on him in terms of like um, any type of uh, bag or anything like that? Yeah, you have a little bag. What? Okay, do you remember the color of the movie bag? It was like a black with the little bag. The microphone is sensitive, so you'll have to be careful. <laughs> um, uh, say it again. Uh, it was a black, the little black shoulder bag that you have with the blue bag. Okay. I'm going to ask you, during the time that you were there and you were walking around, did anything stand out to you about the Louis bag that caused you to say something to John yeah. Zane? What is that? I see like the morning was some one morning push out that I, I touched when I said close money the person. money and coming out. And he said, okay, bro, and he put it up. No, oh, okay, you right, bro. When you say money, you're talking about U.S. currency right. cash you saw sticking out of US, the bag? Yeah, it was U.S. Were you able to tell, um, are we talking, and I understand you may not have counted it, but was it a large amount, small amount? I just see him a what? A little piece of the money pushing. <laughs> okay. You just said it was open. And once um you indicated, well, why did you indicate for him to close up the bag? Why did you say that? Because the money exports it, and I was like, why well, don't hold it like that? So I was telling the money just put it up. Okay. So you were looking out for him. Yeah. In order to tell him so that nobody else would see it. See, yeah. Okay. Um. Now, after you tell him to close up the bag, and he does, what do you guys do while you're in there? Yeah. So we're walking around, we went upstairs. What's upstairs? Bike as well. What? How long would you say you were in Riva Motorsports looking at motorcycles? About five minutes to an hour. And you okay. were to five the minutes to an hour? About potentially making a purchase. Yes. Five minutes to an hour. What, if anything, did Jose purchase that day? Do you know why? Maybe you don't see the buyer that you didn't want. Okay. What if anything next happened when you then are, he doesn't purchase the bike? What do you do? What do the both of you do? We walk out, go to the car. Okay. And the same um, BMW sports vehicle that you drove in? Yes, ma'am. So who's driving? Now, as you're trying to leave. Just leave. And where are you positioned in the car? The same passenger seat. Who, if anybody, is in the car with you? Just me and just me. Okay. Now, before we get to when you're actually trying to leave, what was Jose's mood like when you were there with him? He was in a mood. Okay. How do you know? What it, like, what, give us some, a, uh, if you could describe his demeanor. Actually, it was just, it's just moving when you come outside. Actually, when you come outside, okay? Um, we were walking to the car. On the side there, someone, a white guy, and a girl was there sitting. They asked him for a picture. The guy asked him for a picture. And he was like, no, bro, I'm cool, I'm cool, I'm cool. And he just moved on. 
When I look around on the guy, he was like, I see the guy. He does not deserve it. Okay, so a fan potentially asked him for a picture and he said no. Yeah, I think the only guy that's a fan. Okay, now, how about inside the store? His demeanor. Describe his demeanor. You said he was happy. How'd he up? He was just walking around looking at the bike. Just, you know, he was asking the sales representative on all the bikes and maybe, you know, what he was like. Okay. I don't see the bike, like, the only can see that, that you definitely don't see the bike or if you want. Okay. So now, take us back outside. You're leaving. He just denied a photograph for a fan. Mm -hmm. And how long does it take from the time you're inside to walk to the car? I mean, like two or three minutes to walk to the car. All right. Were there any other cars that looked like Jose's car in that parking lot that you saw? No one. And when you are leaving, do you know how many exits or entrances there are to Viva Motorsports? No, I don't know. So tell us then what happens next. You get in the car with Jose and what happens next? Okay, you get in the car. You are driving out by the, at the exit. When you pull up, you stop. You look at the left. I look to the right. And you look to the left. When you look to the left, by the time you look to the left, I see a, a car just coming down black. Black, black the entrance pulled by the entrance. After the car pulled by the entrance, two person jump out of the oh, side of the really? Jump out of the car. Oh, really? Just say side one, come on the side of the oh, All right, let's talk about that for a second. When you say two persons, what gender were they? Men. Were you able to tell what race they were? No, no. Why not? Because were they wearing anything to obstruct their identity? I can't remember what they were dressing at the time. Say that again? I can't remember what they were dressing at the time. After so long, I just, I don't remember. Okay. Was there anything covering their face? That's the thing I can't remember. Well, okay. so you don't remember it. don't recall, if anything, what the two people looked like that jumped out of the car. Yeah. Are we too? What, if anything, did they have in their hands? <laughs> <laughs> put the ring around me. Put it up. Okay. When they what? jump out of the car, I will say the shorter one go by Jesse's side. The taller one was at the front. He was like in style. Me. Okay. So. I know. He. He up. The taller one pulled to my front. Right. Go ahead. This is a car. Yeah. Driver's seat. Passenger seat. Front of the car. Go ahead and show us what you want to do. The taller one was like this. You don't come out the effing car. And he was like, with a gun. You don't come out the effing car. You don't come out the effing car. The shorter one was at Jassy's side. Come step down, please. How close was the taller one to the front of the car if these are the two front seats? Yeah, pull his ass out so he can show us. You don't come out of the car. You say the car. You say the car. Don't come out of the car. I was like, no. Okay, so where were you seated out of these two seats? I was in the passenger seat. Sit down. So I'm going to say the passenger seat is where you were seated? Yeah. And he was like, you don't come out of the car. You say the car. Don't come out of the car. So I was like, but at that time I was like, was, oh, I thought it was just it. So uh -huh. it was just it. Don't it come out of the fucking car, but then when you're saying, and I understand we're car. in court, you're saying effing car. Did he actually say effing car, or did he say you don't come out of the fucking car? What did he say? Really? Really? Okay. <laughs> and who was he referring to when he said that? Why was he saying that to you? What were you doing? He was fine with the girl at me, and the next one was a He's rather the car. Give him a chain. Where is the chain? Give him a chain. What? Who was saying that and who was he saying it to? Jasse. He was not digging Jasse for a chain. What was Jasse doing in, in 
response to that as, as one of the government is trying to grab in the chain? I didn't know it's not. What the heck you were saying? What is this one? What's this one? Did at any point, or were you aware, did Jose even have any weapons or anything on him that you were aware of? No, I didn't see that. Did you? Were you armed? No. Okay, oh, so tell us yeah, yeah. what happens. After, after all that, I, I tried, I get the door open. How? I was, I sit I like move my leg like this. Why don't you sit down I and show us? I don't fucking lie. Okay. How do you like open the door the while not being restrained? Like, I know. I was like, I this nigga stiff. Because I was like, if I run, I need to get the shot and I can get it in. But if I sit, ain't no way. <laughs> Need a moment? That's why he shut up. Cause you say I'm dumb as hell. What are you talking about? Yeah, he needs a lot of moments. Hold up. Hello. Okay, I open the car door, and when I open the car door, I get down. When I get down, I stop. I know this motherfucker lying. So the car door the goes up. I run back to the shop. Before you, you go, had to roll you away to get stand. away so nobody would see you. <laughs> and I'll just ask you just a few more questions oh, before you leave. When you open the car door Good. from your side and you were doing a motion with your right hand, oh, is it automatic or is it like a, a manual uh, lever that you have to open the car door? Once I touch the button, the button, the car is Okay, so you touch a button this and it activates the door or doors. Okay. One door, just my door. One door, okay. And and once the door is activated and opened, you basically ran for your life? Yes, ma'am. Do you recall what happened as you're running? Okay. I run, and I keep running two sides of the road like this. Well, no, no. No, the fuck you did. Black shot. When I go up there, I pick up my phone to make up to try to call the cops, and I was like, I see a man in the back, a man in the out there standing in the front. And he was like, don't call the cops. I'm on the phone with them right now. I'm giving them time. Don't call the cops. It's I'm on the phone thing. with them. So I just take off. I still take off my, have my phone in my hand. And I, the first person I called after that, it was Cleo. And Why I, did you call Cleo first? Because the cops, the, someone had already called the cops. And I called Cleo because Cleo is the one and asked me to accompany me. I said, so that's the first person to come to my Oh, fuck, my wow. His mom. Now, at the point that you're calling the video, mom. had anything else happened other than you exited the car for your life? I run that new way down there. The two men that could jump out the car was down there. So you left Jose in the car and the two gunmen were still there? Yes, ma'am. Did you see anything that happened to Jose, Jose and the gunman after that? Okay. Before, when I ran up there, opened the back. The taller guy, as I said, the taller guy went around to Jose's side. The shorter one now come around to the door that I was, my door that I opened, okay. and he go inside the car. Okay. You saw. Oh my god! I didn't see that because I was looking when I run up here and saw some wounded, wounded, some of the man that was on the phone. I keep looking down here. When I keep looking, I realize that the shorter one come around to my side. The taller one go to Jesse's side. Okay, so I'm almost like, that, I'm sorry? And then I heard something like, Hi! Hi! I heard I something I like, bye, bye. What in the f- And it's an explosion? Yeah. Have you ever heard, um, I know, firearms fire in your life? Send him to jail. Okay, so I understand you're trying to describe what it sounded like, but did, had, did it sound similar to you that you've that you heard that sound before? The sound, the sound was in the room like that. I just hear yeah. it. How many times did you hear that, like, explosion sound? I can't recall how much time, but I know I hear it. And how long after you raised your life did you hear that explosion sound? It was like... 
Back up. A minute or two. When you saw the two gunmen, the shorter one on the passenger side and the taller one on Jose side, how long after you saw those gunmen positioned like that did you hear the explosion? Actually, actually in the same, same, like, I would say, like, in the middle of the time, it's more than a That's a long fucking time. What did you do next? The vehicle, the, 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 the guy that blocked us, he drove off, and then I go back, and I see everybody going down to the car, so I go down here, too. And what did you see? Jesse was just like, was he conscious? I don't see he was moving. He was moving at the Was he injured? I don't know. Okay. I don't um, know. The car that blocked you off, do you This nigga ever you know what? What in the dick is he? No, I don't recognize what kind of car is it like that. What side of the vehicle did the two gunmen exit the car? The side of the vehicle. The car was going on the south, so they come out on the right hand side. That's the passenger side. The passenger side, okay. Both gunmen came out of the passenger side? One from the one, yes, one come from the back door and one from the front Okay. So both gunmen came out from the passenger side, one from the front passenger and one from the back passenger. Yes, ma'am. Were you able to see if there was anybody else in the car? No, ma'am. Do you know if the gunman that came out from the passenger side slid over from the driver's side or not? No, I can't tell that. Okay. And um, you didn't see anybody else in the car from no. your vantage point? No, ma'am. Uh, you remain behind, correct, in order to cooperate and give the statement yes. to the police when the uh, police eventually showed up? Yes, ma'am. The whole day I was there. So you know. Say that again? I was there the whole time until everybody was there the police. Man, we can't hear this nigga. No, good.
Lil Boosie, Mr. Magic, Rocco. The list just goes on, you know what I'm saying? I'm rocking with my girl, Amber Alert, on the takeover, on the AATI network. Hey, it's Riff. You rocking with Gemini the Queen. What up, man? It's your boy DJ Nothing Nice, Demi RDB, Orlando, Florida. You know, the palm tree lifestyle. That's how we get down. Grammy member, engineer, producer, RIAA member. You know, just uh, entrepreneur worldwide. You know, just rocking, doing what we do right here. You know what I'm saying? With your home girl, the Gemini, the queen, on Amber Alert. You know, we just we just we just doing what we do. You know what I'm saying? We doing the big boy things. You know what I'm saying? Doing the big boy things. You know what I'm saying? You got to do the big boy things. You feel me, player? But it is what it is, man. Holla at your boy, man. DJ, nothing nice, man. We in here, man. Let's go. Blah.